now we have to add the functionality on our app basically we have to add a list of songs all right and we have to add a functionality to play the music okay so first of all what we have to do we have to you know create a data okay so we have to create a data so i'm gonna create one folder called data inside the uh, data folder i'm gonna create another file that is called songs uh, with category songs with category dot js okay and i'm gonna you know create one variable uh, export export const uh, songs uh, with category okay so basically how it's gonna data will be gonna look like so it's gonna be one object and inside that it's gonna be a title like what is the category name okay the title so let's suppose uh, if, you, if you are working for if you want the category name will be recommended song so we can have a, a recommended uh, recommended uh, songs recommended uh, okay let's do like that recommended uh, recommend recommended for you all right so let's make it like this and we're gonna have uh, some songs so i'm gonna add a uh, songs like this and look how we gonna add a uh, songs right so that's one of the most important thing so before that uh, we also gonna use one package that is called react native track player okay so let's search for react native track player now if you scroll down this is the web type, website rntp.to you have to open with this weapon this website so click on get it started so basically whenever you are using this uh, uh, you know to play uh, like you know if you're working on music player functionality so you have to, first of all you have to install this so we will install this later before let's make the data first of all so the data which we want we want you know the url title artist okay and the artwork like this okay so first of all what we need let's suppose uh, for this app i'm gonna using this you know ncsmusicwebsite.com so first of all what i'm gonna do i'm gonna let's suppose uh, i want to add these songs like popular release category and let's suppose if i click on this song okay after that i'm gonna click on download track so it will get downloaded as you can see that once it get downloaded i'm gonna also you know op open the image in, image in new tab it bit low quality i think okay no problem open image in new tab i'm gonna copy this link okay before that you have to go to the, this website react native track player like this okay let me again you have to visit this, this website click on get started after that you have to click on uh, getting started and you have to copy this object okay so i just copy this object and after that here we are having a one songs array inside the song array we have to create one object like this and we have to paste this all the things okay now here let me explain you guys what we need uh, what is the one of the most important things for app uh, so let me tell you guys so first of all uh, the, the url the audio file url the artist uh, basically this uh, artist you know and album we don't need we can get rid of generation uh, artwork okay so in this form we have to pass the data basically these keys are required okay that's the like you know main funder like if you are using react native track player it won this all the key pair okay so first of all uh, let's copy the okay so we have to let's suppose i'm using this uh, song royalty okay this song my bad uh, let me copy this song name uh, this this is a song song name right so i just copy the name i think royalty is the name if i'm not wrong yeah royalty is the name of the song so i'm gonna title with royalty and the artist name is what the artist name is uh, i think let me copy this only is god the first artist name artist is as god and the thumbnail url the artwork means the thumbnail url we want so let me copy the thumbnail url like this copy this url and after that i'm gonna add this in the artwork all right now we want the music player url right this uh, music url okay so how we can get this music well we are not able to get the music url here right so first of all i downloaded this instrument uh, this track after that you have to open the super base or you can open the uh, you know uh, firebase as well so super base has one thing that is called firebase sto stories so you have to click on super base the open source firebase alternative once you click on that you will uh, went to this, this website okay so click on start project start your project so why we're using uh, superbase basically we are going to use superbase to store our musics okay now click on new project and click on 
uh, like my organization if you had not created a super base project uh, super base account it's too straightforward uh, you have to just sign up with uh, google sign up with uh, github whatever you are comfortable once you're done with that you will get to the, this project this interface here we can see all project so you have to click on new project okay and you have to click on choose yourself mdl channel or whatever the username your and i'm gonna create like you know ncs uh, music okay ncs music the database password gonna be uh, i'm gonna just copy this i'm not gonna use database i'm gonna use only one service that service you know uh, basically uh, what do you say i'm gonna i'm using this only service uh, storage service so i don't i'm not using database service but yeah let's create a project so i just create a new project after this once you create a project you will see on the sidebar uh, options okay so you can see there is one option called storage you have to click on the storage on the, this button storage so let's click on storage once more and all right uh, after that uh, okay so as you can see that currently project is set up setting up the project so let's wait for some seconds once the project is set up we will click on this uh, storage and on this storage we are going to upload our music make sense so basically uh, you can in the storage we can upload our music uh, images whatever you want you can upload that image and you will get the url make sense and after that we are going to add that url all right clear so before that uh, you can see that uh, what we had done right now we had created one object song with category okay inside this uh, title we define the title uh, the title is like recommended for you and after that we are having a songs and inside the songs we are having url the what is the song url the title whatever the title gonna be artist name it could be here and the artwork is thumbnail basically and uh, there's one more thing that is url which we are gonna add it after some seconds so as you can see that our project is successfully uh, set up up and after that you have to click on storage once it's created storage now after that uh, you have to click on new bucket okay so let me create on new bucket quickly uh, so i'm gonna make a, a name of bucket gonna be uh, my app or anything like ncs uh, ncs like that and i'm gonna make it public bucket for now and i'm gonna click on save anyone can read any object so i make it public so i can any user can read the songs okay now as you can see that we had created our bucket so upload your file you can just drag your file here all right like drop your files here or you can also click on upload file button and upload your song let's upload one song here so as you can see that it started uploading one file but we are getting one error we are getting error because you know that this song name you know the name of the if i show you the song name it has a special character which uh super base doesn't allow so it should be you know uh, in the camel case or it should be like this if i show you so it's, it should be song like this okay so this in this manner the song name should be like it should be a one casing like there should be no extra space like that okay so if i click on upload file uh, another song this file name one.mp3 it will easily get uploaded so let's wait for some seconds so as you can see that the file get uploaded all right now after that once the file get uploaded you have to click on this icon and if you click on get url okay the co you had copy the url once you copy the url you have to go here okay and you have to just add this url okay now as you can see that we had uh, you know created one object of this recommended for you songs here we added the song url okay and after that uh, we had added the title artist and the artwork okay now like this we are going to download some more songs and uh, going to add some more songs all right so first of all i'm gonna close this tab to the right and i'm gonna search ncs uh, music okay once i search nc music i'm gonna open on this website and let me close this click on this logo ncs and after that i'm gonna download this uh, this uh, music uh, so let's click on this music cradles and click on download track okay so it will start downloading okay now as you can see that the file is has been downloaded and i'm gonna name as a two for now and i'm gonna create on bucket now let's upload file and i'm gonna upload the second file as well all right the second file is also get uploaded in some seconds now after that let's go to this website open image in new tab copy the image url but it's bit you know low quality okay okay let's try with the another image quality because i don't prefer the low quality image 
Okay, so I'm gonna copy the name. Uh, the name is Suburban. The name is Cradles. Okay, so I'm gonna copy this name again. Like you know, copy this whole object. All right, and I'm gonna name as a uh, Cradles, and the artist name is uh, if I show you, the artist name is Suburban. Okay, so let's add the artist name here. Okay, and uh, we want the you know uh, what we want uh suburban and we want the uh, song url so let's go to the bucket let's click on right click on this get url after that close this add this uh, song url here like this and let's add this any image so for the image what i'm gonna do guys let's go back and i think this image uh, looks quite bit well so as you know that i'm using one extension that is called view background image so let's click on this and i'm gonna use this image okay and let's replace this image url with the new one or else what you can do now if you don't want to you know use this url you can just download the image save images and once you download that you can just you know upload any kind of file and use it on you will get the url all right now after that uh, you had created two object okay so what i'm gonna do guys i'm gonna create one another file that is called songs.js okay and here what i'm gonna do i'm gonna create one uh, object like you know export uh, to make it much more readable for you got guys const uh, recommended song recommended uh, recommended songs is equal to an array like this and here i'm gonna copy this whole array like this cut this array from here okay and we are going to the song.js file and i'm gonna paste this like this my bad oh, oh 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 my bad my bad so i'm gonna copy this whole object like this so let us collapse this and i'm gonna cut this okay now let's go to the song.js and i'm gonna add it here like this all right and if we go here we are having a recommended song category uh, like key let's go to the song with category here we're gonna import that array of data awesome now we're gonna add some more songs here and we can have a as you can see that have we had it just two items so like this i'm gonna add more item so so let's add uh, this song a uh, donor song so i'm gonna click on this after that click on download track the song will get downloaded and this is how you can you know add the more song so i will add some more songs so let's upload this file uh, click on this uh, I'm gonna make it three for now and I'm gonna upload this file open so the song will get uploaded and I'm gonna open image in new tab okay it's the image looking pretty well which I loved it and after that I'm gonna replace this image uh, with this uh, new one and the song name is almost uh, Donna so let's copy the name Donna okay and uh, Donna and the artist name is uh, only I'm taking the first artist name sorry for that bro but yeah, it's on D. Okay, this is how we can add a uh, more item. But yeah, let's add the song, uh, you know, as well. So I'm gonna clicking on this, click on this, and get URL. Once I get the URL, and uh, let me add it as well. All right. Now what we had done here, let me explain you guys. I'm gonna close all the tabs. Okay. So first of all, we had created one, you know, one object, one array of ob one array of objects. Here we are calling this ob array of object called song card with category. The first key is called title inside the title we are having a naming as a like recommended for you and another key is called songs and inside the songs we are having a, a, a like you know we are having an array of objects that is called recommended songs and here we are having url title artist and the artwork so the url is like you know uh, the song url which we had uploaded on superbase and get that url the title of the song and the artist uh, name and the artwork artwork means image all right now uh, after that what we are going to do we can have a much more data so i will add some more data you know bef uh, under the hood so i'm going to stop my screens here and like i will upload some data on super base okay and we will like you know uh, make it like much more cooler so once you add the data it's gonna be look pretty well so you can add download the date songs from here upload the songs on a music player and you can get the image by click on image url and you can have uh, some data like that after that what we are going to do we are going to render that data here dynamically and we will add the functionality so let's add let's add the data and after that i'm gonna add this uh, functionality on the home screen all right